So, Alexis Sanchez is now linked with Man City for £80 million. Pounds. Not really sure that's a true story, to be honest with you, but what do I know? I didn't think um, we'd sign Lacazette and I thought Wenger was leaving, so... You know, anything's possible. Football's gone crazy the last couple of years in terms of transfer fees and players demanding to leave and going on strike, etc., etc. So, um, my take on it is I don't believe the fee of £80 million. Um, I think his agent's sort of sticking that out there just to put a bit of pressure on Arsenal, really. Um, I think he's a fantastic footballer. I know that much, and I'm sure everyone who's watching this agrees he is one of the best players in the league and the only genuine world-class player we have, in my opinion. Um, if he doesn't want to sign a new contract, we can't force him to sign it. And if he doesn't want to sign it, then I think we should sell him. And if that is to Man City, then yeah, so be it. And I know that's going to sound a little bit controversial. Obviously, we've had Robin Van Persie do it in the past. We've had Ashley Cole, you know, but at the end of the day, the way I see it is we've got a world-class player who's not signed a new contract and gone into the last year of his contract as soon as we, soon as we start the new season. Um, what do we do? If he doesn't want to sign, then sell for as much as we possibly can. And if that means to Man City, that's, that's, that's the issue we're going to we're gonna have to put up with, you know? But if he does sign, then fantastic. We've kept a quality footballer. And obviously with Lacazette up front now, then happy days. But... You know, I I blame Arsenal for letting his contract run down to his last year anyway. So, you know, what do we do? Do we keep a player going into his last contract and let him walk off to Man City for nothing next summer and then have to spend out 50, 60, 70 million to replace him? Or do we just cash in now if he's refusing to sign and, you know, take the money and hopefully go and replace him with either one or two players? You know, I don't know. If if Me personally, I don't think he will leave. I think he will sign a new contract, but I ain't involved in the deal. I ain't obviously part of the club. You know, that's just my opinion. So hopefully we keep him. But if, like I said, if he doesn't want to sign a new contract, sell him immediately. Anyway, let me know what you guys think. Leave your comments down below. Stick a massive like on the video. I appreciate all the love. And uh, yeah, thanks a lot. Enjoy the rest of your weekend.